of our viewers from around the world we have quite a game in prospect let's start here. the game Just here it's emerge, Croatia and England underway. for the semi-finals Jeez, of the 2018 Croatia World Cup I really am not sure who's gonna win it but for this game I'm be using as Croatia because I think they're the weaker side I really think in real life England might just do it might just go to finals but you know eventually what happens in the finals will definitely be a, a very different thing I didn't update the lineups um, basically the keeper is not picked for it, but uh, you know Joe Hart I think England will wear a white and Croatia because of their red color shirt will, will pretty much uh, wear their away kit so it's both away kits for each of the, of the team and pretty much this is the game that I think you know England might just win it um, they're a very strong side I mean although yes you know um, I really think that they can actually do it this time around. But Croatia is a team that I think are very tough. Um, you know, they won their penalty shootout twice. So I think it's going to be really tough for them. It's going to be really tough for England. Uh, let's see. This semi final is going to be a cracker. Croatia, of course, defeating the host nation, uh, Russia, which I think it's a big, big win for them. Winning a penalty shootout against Russia in the home game. Wow, that is one thing. But let's see Croatia if England can, can win it. Well, in this formation, the white players can be the most attacking and sometimes a pair of extra You can actually see it's not the most accurate lineup. Of course, for England, um, you know, Pickford should be the number one. But most of the, I think, other players are pretty much there. Sterling, Deli Ali, Harry Kane, Mary Wyatt definitely are playing. So let's start, and I will be playing as Croatia. <coughs> let's see. Let's get things on the way. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? This is a, a tricky one, but you know I'm gonna go for Alex Oxlade Chamberlain because uh -huh. he can be oh. I think a key oh, I wanted to pass somewhere is. else. What a chance. A terrific run no, I wanted to pass somewhere a else, run. but it just went away. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind are, are being made like that. Croatia certainly won't want to look back and, and dwell Oh my on word, what a mistake! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> in real life he would have scored right oh look at the what def what happened there it's been a while since I played pass it's been a while so you know oh my word and I prefer to say underdog teams but it will be more challenging that's why I put Croatia I know they are a storm team, England but in this World Cup, you have to say England are just having all the luck in their lives. I mean, you know, winning against Colombia and all. It's a through ball. Lovely card, maybe a chance. Oh, nobody there. Gets good distance on it. Come on. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Racketed. Oh. Packer. It's a G Packer. Oh, almost. I think Pickford has been a such a great, great keeper Too strong for, his for England so far. I'm not sure whether. He will be in form, you know, once the World Cup is over, but that guy definitely beat all odds. I mean, I'm, I'm, of course, England have won the World Cup before, have, have won semis before, you know, uh, but...
but you know he have been underperforming really much a long long time if England are going to win this World Cup it's now it's now or never uh, that's my opinion because if not then you're gonna you know the next few World Cups in Germany are gonna be there Italy are gonna be there and you know we haven't been tested I mean I'm not an England fan but I'm just saying that you know this time around they are a different team they are a team that could win against you know good teams and you know they they just lost 1-0 but still I think they're very good so let's focus on the game which is really hold forward here 24 minutes on Lovely flick, lovely pass. Oh, just too high. Oof, very nervous. Sterling. Sure, come on, go defend it, defend. Go defend. What are you doing? What are you doing, you idiot? Oi! Oh my shit, he is! <laughs> oh! You know, Pest, they always score goals like that. I have played a lot of World Cup games, you can see my previous videos. Belgium are the best team to use. They just win it so easily, especially against Brazil, Argentina. They just like win it like, you know, like no big deal. I mean, I don't know, their formation, their players. Belgium, I think, is the team to beat. And anything England can can win against Belgium in the final, I think they deserve all the credit because Belgium is a uh, side in power now. They just beat Brazil. I'm not sure if England would have done that, but you never know in this World Cup. It's one thing that's why we love the World Cup. It's very unpredictable. You know, sometimes things goes your way. Sometimes they don't. Very hard to predict. On. Oh, almost. This World Cup has been, I think, a very entertaining World Cup. I just thought if, you know, if a more underdog teams could have gone to the finals or semi final, would be great. Oh, uh, no go oh, is it a chance? Shit. Come on. What are you doing? Oh no. Oh shit. What the hell? Bro. You're gonna make him score. Just clear it. Oh. That was some nervous moments there. Croatia. What are you doing, man? Croatia. Come on. It's your moment now. Looks like a good ball through. Deli Ali. Come on, Deli Ali. Ah. Come on, Croatia. I know you're a better team than this. Come on. Oh, nil nil. Boring first half. Stop second half, half sure. Croatia worked the aerial route pretty well, even if it is predictable and a, a bit one dimensional, so I'd expect less of that. A bit more variation from here. After 45 minutes, it Come is on. still goalless. A change perhaps after half time. Lovely. I'm not sure they're going to use this white kit, but England have been very fortunate with the red kit, so I think if they want to win, you know they won the 1966 World Cup with their red kit. The red kit is like their most, you know, be best good luck charm really. So to England, you know, tell your manager, go and wear a red kit, tell FIFA that you, know, you if you don't wear the red kit, you, you're not going to, you're not going to play. <laughs> that would be the you know I mean yeah I mean they've been not the best in their white kit in 2005 in 2014 
Looks to slip it through. And it's Kovacic. Come on, this opening. Kovacic. Kovacic! Ooh. Oh, no shortage of confidence there. Oh my so word, how did that go wide? Goal. Okay, he, he was running, go going away, shoot, oi, yeah, that's well wide. France and Belgium, I think Belgium can win it. I really think they deserve to win it after what a super performance. There's a good chance. It's a chance to be to go! Rabbit! Oh my word. Hart did well the first time. Nothing he could do about the follow up. Well, that's not the best. That's one thing about Pickford. He always does that bounce. But, you know, I'm not sure. Look at that deflection goal. I think I'm top player. It's one nil. It's got to be the, the second hardest, not the hardest, it's the second hardest. That's it, legend. I'm not, I think it's top player, yes, yeah, top player. This isn't top player. So, all of you taking that I'm, you know, it's 1 0, it's come on. I mean, if I'm playing an amateur, it could have been 5 by now. 7 1. You know what Germany did to Brazil? That was so absolutely embarrassing, man. What has Brazil? And you thought that they could, you know, win this World Cup, but what? It, he just lost it. I don't know. Oh, it's taken out. That'll be a foul. He gets a ticking off and, and needs Harry to be Kane. very careful now. Undergoing treatment. Sterling. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. There's not too much subtlety oh, or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. For well, any of you wondering, this is the this smoke is patch for the World Cup. Kits are updated, players are updated. I mean, I just like tests compared to FIFA. But the next year, I'm not. I mean, I'm not going to show if the ball through. With the license, the through this ball. lovely chance. Keeper sees it all the way. Oi. I think we should substitute someone now. Actor for Brazovic. Parasic maybe for Rebic. And maybe Perversic for Luka Modric. What? Luka Modric not playing? He's like the star for Croatia. Man. If we can win without Luka Modric 1 0, we definitely can win against uh, England. Tries a through ball. What a chance. I'm not sure why it shows HRV at the, at the scoreboard. Shouldn't be COR. We'll change it later. One thing about Pes, you can change everything. Peter, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh, oi, 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 what, what, oh, oh, oh my, we, we were lucky there, man. Look at this idiot. He, okay, he missed it, he passed. I asked him to clear. Now uh, that's just well before. Well, Croatia, what are you doing? Vida. Don't you want to win a World Cup? You know, England have won it in 1966. But, you know, I, I really hope, you know, somebody, a new team wins the World Cup. You know, like, Belgium and, and Croatia are the only team that haven't won it. I really think that, you know, at this stage, <clears throat> I think other countries also deserve. You know, Portugal. Spain have won it, France have won it, I mean, Netherlands is such a pity for Netherlands, I mean, they have been, they deserve one title at least, no. And it's Kane. 
they have been one of the most unluckiest team. But here's the defending. Offside. Come on, Vida. Perisic. They got the only goal to make it 1 0. Now it's Rakitic. He's going to play the ball in the corner. Rakitic passes it through. Perisic. Aimed in towards the centre. Oh, he didn't hit it. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed. But I might do a there. France and Belgium version of the PES commentary simulation. I'm going to be playing as uh, Belgium. I really love them. Looks to slip it Definitely. Cut out in the nick of time. What are you doing? He almost scored, man. Have plenty in the middle. Oh, that the guy. Aerial route and will do so with numbers. Modric. And it's Van Cukic. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Sorry, that is a foul. I had to do that. I'm not sure. Maybe in real life it's going to be some cagey game. I definitely think it's going to be very cagey. Might go go to a penalty shootout. Harry Kane injured. That is not good for England. Sterling going through. And he's there to cut it out. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation. And it needs to be any time now, really. Come on, Croatia. Just a few minutes left. One more goal. Seal the deal. First World Cup final since 1998. I'm all for the underdog winning. Whitman Jukic. Modric. Oh, what embarrassing pass. It's all over. Prediction. Croatia wins 1-0, but you're never gonna, gonna know um, with that, you know, one rebound goal. Very cagey game. So, that's about it. With that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.